Hey everyone, so I thought today I would do a little update video on my channel and a little bit of a life update on why I have not been around and uploading. Um, if you follow Polish, you probably realize that there was a collection that released and I didn't swatch it. Um, do the live swatch portion of that. Uh, you're probably wondering why. So on Instagram, I did I do put my swatches on Instagram and a couple of really big nail pages reshared one of my swatches. You know, sometimes it's like a snowball effect. You get one page that will share it, like that has like 1 million, 2 million uh, followers on Instagram. And then some other pages will see that and then they'll repost it. So it kind of got reposted a few times on Instagram. It was the, I'll put the name of the polish that got um, reshared on the bottom part of this video. But, um, there were some comments in these big pages comment sections that were talking about my nails and the staining and it really really disappointed me and put me off um yes I have stained nails yes they look bad I know it looks bad to have stained nails it's something I'm constantly trying to figure out what am I gonna do to um, curb the staining while I do swatching and because um, it, it is a lot of work to do base coat, then let that dry, then do the swatches, then top coat. It's a lot of work to add the extra step in there. So the only thing I think of is to maybe um, put like a layer of gel down to protect my nail and then do the swatches on top of that. But some of the people's comments were pretty hurtful and... Um, it just kind of bothered me and I know I'm on the internet and I shouldn't let this stuff bug me but it just I kind of wanted to let my nails grow out just so some of the staining would be gone but yeah that was kind of one of the reasons why I have not been as active on YouTube and doing nail art videos also my nails are in really really bad shape right now um, they are peeling they are breaking they are just really bad um, so I've been also trying to figure out how to fix that. My middle finger has a major split down the middle of it and it peels from both sides and I don't know what caused that, but it's very, very frustrating, um, especially since my thing is nails and it's disheartening, but, um, I do plan on doing more swatch videos, um, it's just, it's going to take some time for me to get rid of the staining. So, I've thought about filing it off. I've thought about, um, I, I don't know. I just, it's just frustrating. But, um, also, if you're following this channel for the Project Pan videos, I actually moved all of my Project Panning to a different channel. I will leave the link to that channel down below. Um, I thought maybe I would make this channel kind of like beauty and hair and nails but that is not what this channel is. This channel is nails and I do want to incorporate hair. Nails and hair kind of go together. But um, just click the link down below if you want to go to my Project Pan channel. Um, I do Project Panning on there and I'm going to start doing Shop My Stashes and I'm going to start doing Shop My Stashes on this, this channel as well. But that is a little update on what's been going on with me and why I have not been uploading as much lately. I hope you all understand and I am going to be doing a shop my stash video today to show you some things that I want to use this month, some plates, some nail polish, snail, snail, that's <laughs> a snail, nail polishes. So stay tuned for that. I'm going to be recording that right after this video. I have some stamping plates that I've never played with and I want to get use out of them so stay along or stay along. Follow along with me as I do that. Um, thank you all for watching and for sticking around. I really do appreciate it. I know I only got 350 subscribers, but you all have stuck with me for this long, and I really do appreciate it. Um, I appreciate all your support and understanding. So I will talk to you all soon.